He brings athleticism. He brings toughness. He brings grit. He's played in some of the biggest games that we've had. He's got a love for Kerry Grove. He just brings all the things that you see on the field, but he also brings all the other intangibles with him as well. Blake's always been the kid to be the fullback and get those extra yards while carrying three guys on him. I loved playing with Blake. He's always got a good attitude during the games. He's always been excited for each and every game. And we have a lot of things in common, which, which plays a role too on the field. And it really creates that true bond. Running out here of the alumni building on Friday nights is something that's really undescribable. There's no position I'd rather play than fullback. I love the physicality of it. Getting the ball a lot's fun too. And I also like seeing if I get tackled and I see my quarterback, one of my slots, run 75 yards down the field and seeing the defensive tackle confused as one of my running backs or quarterbacks in the end zone. It's awesome. You do see him grind every single day at practice. That rubs off on the entire team and then they use that as motivation to keep going through the practice. I want them to remember me as someone who works hard. I want to be a leader and I want to lead by example. I want them to see me as a you know, good person who does good things in the community and show them that if you finish you know, five yards extra every play and if you have a true determination to do something, you can succeed in it. I think we have an all-in culture. I think we have a culture that rewards hardworking kids. I think it's extremely disciplined. I think we're looking forward to show that we did prove something, that we did win a state championship, and that also that we do have to prove ourselves again, which we are ready for, and that we're really hungry to win another state championship and go to DeKalb. Within our team, we have a lot of competition for positions, for depth chart, and for things like that. And then once we're competitive within ourselves, it allows us to be competitive on Friday nights. And so that's really kind of been another key to our success. The goal is still the same. We have new leaders coming up who've done a great job so far. And I think if we work together as a team, we'll achieve our goal. The way that our kids work and their attention to detail and their drive to be great, I think you're gonna see a team that improves tremendously from week one to week nine.